Princess Rajwa made a rare official meeting with her husband, Crown Prince Hussein of Jordan, the eldest son and daughter-in-law of King Abdullah II and Queen Rania visited the Digitals days before the birth of their first child. Princess Rajwa, who rarely appears in public and is not yet accustomed to official events after her marriage, decided to accompany her husband on this visit. Rajwa Al Saif, an architect by training, married the eldest son of King Abdullah II and Queen Rania in June 2023. Joining the Hashemite royal family, Rajwa has yet to embrace her new royal life, choosing not to make any official commitments for the time being. Princess Rajwa's presence with her husband was all the more surprising as she is expecting her first child. The birth date of the heir's firstborn child has not yet been named, but it is known that the baby is due in the summer. On Wednesday, Princess Rajwa's rounded belly confirmed the progress of her pregnancy. Princess Rajwa looked very casual during the visit. Prince Hussein of Jordan, the eldest son of King Rania and King Abdullah, turned 30 a few weeks ago, and this is the last birthday he celebrated before becoming a father. The other day his wife, Princess Rajwa, will give birth to their first son or daughter, which could mean a new heir to the Jordanian throne. This possibility has not yet been confirmed, as much depends on whether the child will be a boy, which is still unknown. It should be remembered that currently women cannot be heads of state in Jordan, so if it were a girl, she would not have the opportunity to succeed her father when the time comes. If it were a boy, he would be the next heir to the throne as determined by his father, who now occupies that role, but he didn't always occupy it. In fact, after King Hussein passed away, it was the son by Queen Noor, Prince Hamza, who was supposed to succeed his brother Abdullah. However, the monarch decided to name his eldest son as heir in 2009, when Hussein was still a teenager. If we follow this trend, and if Hussein now has a son, it is only natural that the future prince will succeed him when the time comes. The trend will only change if he has no sons, in which case the line will probably pass to his brother, 19-year-old Prince Hashem. Although he is now happily married and soon to be a father, Hussein has been on the royal family's golden bachelor lists in recent years, both because of his position and his attractiveness. Today, the eldest son of King Rania and King Abdullah continues to generate passion everywhere and maintains a very close relationship with his parents, especially his mother, whom he adores. Hussein is a prince of his time, with an open and cosmopolitan nature, used to socializing with people from different parts of the world. He currently holds the rank of captain in the armed forces. Moreover, in 2017, he graduated from the prestigious Sandhurst Military Academy in the UK, where he managed to meet Prince William of Wales, with whom he has a special friendship. We have been able to see them together many times in an environment of complicity. For example, he and Kate Middleton attended the wedding of Hussein and Rajwa in the Jordanian capital. In addition to his military training, Prince Hussein attended the Royal Academy in Jordan and graduated with a degree in international history from Georgetown University, where King Philippe VI also earned a master's degree in international relations. Hussein is well aware of his role and has participated in numerous official events not only in Jordan but also abroad. Moreover, he even acted as regent when his father was out of the country. The role of the youth of his generation and the generations that will follow him is very important to him, so he tries to promote various initiatives to encourage talent and help the young .in, addition to his institutional role. Hussein has a special love for his family, his parents and siblings. So now that he is about to become a father, we are likely to see him involved in this new role that will bring joy to the entire royal family. Princess Rajwa, despite her rare publicity and lack of official commitments, took the significant step of accompanying her husband, Crown Prince Hussein, to an official meeting. 
The visit was particularly noteworthy given her pregnancy and the impending birth of their first child. As an architect by profession, the princess has not yet fully adapted to her new role in the royal family, but her presence at the event demonstrates her willingness to gradually engage in public life. The birth of Prince Hussein and Princess Rajwa's first child could be an important event for the royal family and the whole of Jordan. The question of succession to the throne remains open, especially given the traditions and laws regarding succession through the male line. If a son is born, he will be the potential heir continuing the dynastic line. If a daughter is born, however, the succession could pass to Hussein's younger brother, Prince Hashem. Prince Hussein, with his modern and cosmopolitan outlook, is active in his country and international affairs. His education and military background, as well as his close ties with other royal families, such as the British, make him a significant figure on the world stage. His commitment to supporting youth and developing talent underscores his desire to progress and modernize Jordan. In the near future, we are likely to see Prince Hussein combining his official duties with his new role as a father. His love of family and devotion to his parents and siblings will undoubtedly play an important role in his approach to raising a child. This event will bring joy not only to the royal family but also to the entire country, strengthening the bond between the monarchy and the people.